You wind me up. Everyone's naked. Hi oh, boys! Look at that. I love fit! We are the hardest working app properly on the internet. Hello, people. Just wanted to have a little chat. Uh, be real with you, it's a little catch up for the week. It's been crazy. It's been, it's been nuts. I've not even been here a week yet and already we've got so much done. Like, one, two, three. We've recorded four covers. We've filmed three covers. It's been a real busy week and this trial is gonna overlap the boys doing the Dynamite tour and the third EP. That's also really exciting but kind of nerve wracking. It's an important time for the band. And to be honest, I'm just really grateful to be here. Like, I don't know. I never know what to say at this kind of stuff. It's all a bit, like this isn't a usual situation for a person to be in. Look at what's going on. <laughs> like the boys do some seriously cool stuff and this is this is a seriously big opportunity. So I just wanna make sure that I grab it with both hands and make sure I'm doing everything I need to be doing and more for the boys and for the fans like you guys, the roadies and for Blair. Just in all aspects, I know that I need to really like step up now. Obviously, I. I this isn't an opportunity I want to waste. I've I've had previous experience in a band before. I loved it. It was the best thing. I had the time of my life. And from there, it kind of went a bit like... Like, I, I stopped with the music. I went and got a job and whatnot, working on the railway. Like, my, he my headspace when I left the last band, or when the last band finished, rather, should I say, was that I've done this now. I'll go back. I'll get a job. And I think the only reason I did that was because in my head, the kind of dream of being in a band, like in a boy band, was kind of over for me. I didn't think it was going to work out anymore. And I've got to be honest, it, it wasn't a time I massively enjoyed. I went from doing what I love doing and singing, making music, playing shows, to wearing a great big orange Harvey's jacket in blue rubber gloves in the middle of the night, cleaning trains. Like, I'm thinking this ain't for me like this is not what i want to do i spoke to blair one day during a catch up and i said like i want to get back into music i, I want to be part of a band again and blair was kind of helping me out with with doing that kind of pointing me in the right direction and whatnot and then yeah uh i was contacted uh from blair and the lads and they said look is it something you'd be interested in doing and and of course of course that's something i'd be interested in doing any any sane person would not turn down would not turn down an opportunity like this it's been a crazy week so far and I'm excited for next week to be honest. I just wanna, I wanna kind of just do as much as I can during my trial period. I know that I've got something to prove to you guys, the fans, to the boys. Hey, hey mate! <laughs> what is going on mate? <laughs> Do I want to give it a poke? <laughs> Yours actually looks like a full on. How has he managed that? Look, look. That's actually so impressive. And yeah, uh, the first day I got here, literally everyone was so welcoming. Like, uh, right straight away. He like he had a good old like a long chat with me and was basically explaining like how the days work. You know, it was like don't be nervous. Like musically, Andy, me and Andy have been good friends for a long time, but Andy musically has been helping me so much. Things with like how your tone is and harmonies and things like that to make sure it blends right. Andy's. And he's been an absolute star. Uh, Jack, to be fair, me, me and Jack, we have a lot in common. I feel like even aside from the band, me and Jack, if we just bumped into each other in normal real life, me and Jack would be real good pals. Like <laughs> Me and Jack got on well. We've spent a lot of time with each other so far. And Brooke. Come on, man. Brooke's just an angel, any Brooke. Brooke is the man. Brooke just comes in and cheers everyone up. And Brooke's been honest. Brooke's been awesome. Like, like the first studio day when I did a take, like Brooke took me to one side and was like, "Dude, you're sounding awesome." And honestly, just all the lads individually and as a collective have made me feel so welcome. Even the people behind the scenes, like Robbie, Alex, Connor, they've been so helpful with things like shooting on the videos. They've been real patient with me. And yeah. I just can't, I can't thank everyone enough. I just want to make sure that I just do whatever I can to help us progress as a band. And that is just my main focus now. Like next week, we've got so much to do. We've got to prepare for the tour. This trial process is overlapping a real, real, real crucial time for the boys, for the fans, for everyone involved and anyone that knows anything about Road Trip. You know, and I just want to keep working. The boys work so hard and that's something that I, I really want to keep taking on board. Like, um, what's it called? Ethos, like the band Ethos, if that makes sense. I just need to wear my stripes. I think it was a brave decision bringing a trialist so soon. And I just want to make sure I can repay the boys and you as fans by doing the best I possibly can to make sure that this just takes off. And yeah, exciting times.
We set up cameras around the house, right? We said this, we said stick him in a van, yeah, for a year. And he's not allowed to leave the van, he can live stream the whole thing. Honestly, <laughs> even if we just left the house and don't tell him, watch what he gets up to on his own. <laughs> I reckon for the first day, he'd be really boring, and then he'd get bored of being bored, and just start going around the house being like... <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> he sounds happy just at the thought of it, look. Anyway, Ryan. Interview time, everyone shush your mush. You, hello sir. Hello sir. You've had your first ever studio slash film day. Indeed I have. It was actually really fun. Yesterday we cut all the vocals for the cover. Shut up! Tell that Rob, carry on. Man. Yesterday fine. we cut all the vocals for the cover and then today we went and filmed the video for the cover which was very exciting. We got some cool tings. Uh, honestly, you want to see what's going on over there. <laughs> I don't see anything going on. Nah, no, no, that's very unprofessional, Karen. Yeah, bro. <laughs> very unprofessional. Wrong. See, the first vocal, I was kind of... <laughs> that's very unprofessional. What are you talking about? Very unprofessional. What's he on? What's he laughing You're being very what? unprofessional. Can you carry on, please? Now I've forgotten what I'm saying. <laughs> I'm worried about the reflections in this. Yeah, no. We're not doing anything bad. No, 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 no. Just not doing anything right. Uh, for the first vocal, I was a little bit nervous. I was a bit. Like, <laughs> that wasn't what I was like. <laughs> <laughs> and then as the day went on, it was cool. We really started to get into the swing of things. All the lads helped me out. They've been really good. Like just giving me bits of advice. Other than Andy, Andy doesn't really know what he's talking about. You winding me up. That kid got in that booth, petrified. That was a lie. And I was like, bro. Take your time. Everyone's gonna love you, man. That was a lie. Let, let's just say he was great. A lie. He genuinely was. Came in with a few nerves, but got over them really quickly. Started bantering with the rest of us. Vocally, really strong. And um, yeah, onwards and upwards. What they? Anyway, as you were. Yeah, we're well, carrying on like there's no one else in the room. Um, again, the lads really helped me out. You know, like how to perform in front of the camera and whatnot. Uh, uh, Everyone's naked. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone is naked. What's Ryan's question? Uh, you have to answer this one within two seconds, okay? Straight away, answer. Yeah. If you had to date one of us, which one would you date? <laughs> oh, that was a good! I'll probably date Brooklyn. Oh, yeah. you loser! All taste! Bro, I said he'd f me. Right. <laughs> He's been getting on well with everyone. He's as weird as Brooke, yet as chilled as Jack, and yet as like inquisitive about everything in terms of the band and life as Ryan. So he's fitting really well. Earlier, when we got back from two long days of filming and shooting and everything, he was cleaning in the kitchen. He was. It's a good day you got there, sir. Round of applause! Well deserved. That is a, that's actually quite touching. I know what the round of applause means in this camp. Yeah, what's the opposite of a koala or a brick? And it just is, isn't it? It is though. The opposite of a koala in every sense is a brick. As you were, it's your interview, man. <laughs> we don't want to take it <laughs> No, um... It is though, think about it, like... <laughs> bricks are hard! That's inappropriate. <laughs> That's still a tough subject for us. It's his song as well now, as much as, much as ours. It's his song first. Oh. Right, let's not even... <laughs> Who's annoyed you the most so far? Probably Andy, but he's had more time to collect some annoying points. You know <laughs> That's I mean? true. Oh, maybe not Andy. Definitely not Andy. He's been great. He's been the most helpful since I've been here, to be honest. Um, none of the boys really like me until nice. Andy had a swift word. Ryan's easily got the biggest... <laughs> heart! <laughs> In the band, he's, he's got a great <laughs> heart in the band. <laughs> okay, so they're all oh, annoying. Right, so on a very serious <laughs> note, which the no, it's not your dinner. I'm just showing you what I've got. Go away. <laughs> on a serious note, <laughs> which as you can tell, there are very few here. It's been an exciting few days. Mm, can I have some cheese, please? Yeah, man. Anyway, bro, it's your interview. You really need to like wrap it up, though. I've been trying for about 15 minutes. Where's hey, we need to have them. Ryan, when's your sorry? I'm sorry. Neo day. Sonny, when is your dull Neo day? <laughs> <laughs> I just came back into that. Hey, quiet. I want to hear his answer. Yeah, no, come on, man. It's his interview. Let's talk. <laughs> oh, I've got the f up. <laughs> 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 right, okay, Andy. Why don't you just be quiet for a moment? <laughs> <laughs> Why don't you just do it? <laughs> Actually, yeah, Andy, could you do that? Could yeah, you yeah, swap. Yeah, swap places. Tap out, man. I'll do it. No, can the fish mind me being up here? I mind you being up here. <laughs> Hi, Hi Sunny. You are right, I'm Ryan. But people call me Sunny. Um, you've only been here two days. I felt like forever. Tell us the story. <laughs> I was just gonna eat like an insane amount of money before I answered. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just gonna keep going. Go on then, then back down now. <laughs> <laughs> 
It's your interview. We'll leave you to it. <laughs> Thank you, Andy. You've been a great help since I got here. Brooke's anus is in my past. <laughs> <laughs> you mean? Right. As the oldest and the wisest. Mine looks school. better than his. You made me drop some pasta on myself. Sonny's fitting really well. He gets on well with everyone socially and in terms of his work ethic. Jack's playing some mad dirty chords <laughs> back there. I fell in love with your face. Keep going. <laughs> Start again, ready? Yeah. I fell in love with your face Ooh. There's so many bran flakes that I could eat Ooh. Cause I'm married to a fish Ooh. I love the fish, baby I love the fish, baby. I love the fish. That's made me emotional, man <laughs> <laughs> Oi, this is Sonny's interview, man Oh yeah, sorry, sorry Back to you I'd like to retract my statement about Marion Brooklyn. He scares the crap out of me. That's not how we speak, mate. What do you, what do you us Essexians. Brook isn't from Essex. Essexians. Throw your fun can. Lick it. <laughs> yeah. yeah, but we got the same accent. Like, so does Charlie Drew, he's from Leicester. No, we don't. <laughs> yeah, he, he speaks like this. Hi, boys. Are you going to make a vocal today, yeah. boys? To oh, bro. Hey, boy. Oh, bro. That sucks. How boy. Oh, that was great, actually, Brooklyn. Yeah, you carry it. Oh, bro. Get out of my studio. Jack, I love you. <laughs> Sorry, Steve. <laughs> anyway, yeah, so Sonny's been getting on really well with everyone. Worked really hard, actually. Like, his first night here, he couldn't really sleep, got up nice and early, and started looking for locations for Sean. Like, ultimately, we didn't use them, but, you know. <laughs> <laughs> um, no, he's on a legit. He's been great. Like, coming musically, like, as ready as we could have hoped for. And we're going to throw him in bigger and better really soon. He's going to stand in a freezer for 24 hours. <laughs> <laughs> on the Matapia! <laughs> Matapia is a technique where <laughs> the word you say sounds like the sound of like, <laughs> like whoosh. Like this. Like the trees whoosh. Pow. Like that. Does Brooke's foot hitting a wall sound like pow? We just want a yes or <laughs> shut STFU Brooke. Brooke, bro, bro, listen. Go on. Pow. <laughs> Wait, Brock, I'll do a deal. You've got a bit of Diet Coke there. If you give me a glass of that, I'll back you to the grave that that sounds like that. Can you, can you give me more leads in the studio tomorrow? <laughs> <laughs> and it's not actually no, forget it's it. Got it. <laughs> well, yeah, welcome, welcome, up. welcome to the man, that's funny. Thank you very much, sir. So you didn't answer any questions, so we'll genuinely leave you alone for like a minute. Go on. Do you want to come back here? Is this like your spot? I reckon each of you should ask him one question. Starting so with... Andy. Ah. Uh. Okay. <laughs> Hi, Sonny. How's tricks? How's tricks? Not how's things? How would you like this? Ha things are splendid. <laughs> there you go. That was easy. If you could change <laughs> one thing about each member from what you've seen so far, what would it be? Ooh. Be brutal, Sonny. I think bring the perm back. You really yeah. love the perm? I really love the perm. If they could get that back, it would be awesome. <laughs> I don't know. I feel like you're expecting some funny answers. <laughs> 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 I think the genius behind that question was to see you suffer. And it's worked. It's worked it's tremendously. <laughs> right, I got one. This is one fans will probably ask you. Yeah, go on. What makes you want to be in a band? What makes me want to be in a band? <laughs> Even though they're laughing about it, we do what we do. I want to be in a band because ultimately we all love music, right? And well, I'm too to sing on my own for a start. <laughs> That should be the swear word now. Bye, bro. Bro, it's your video, man. Yeah, sorry. I want to be in a boy band because I've always been obsessed with like listening to boy bands. The sound, the harmonies are something I've always liked listening to. I listened to a lot growing up when my mum was playing around the house. I've always enjoyed music and I like the idea of being in a band, chilling with a load of people, even if they are, you know. Psychos. These. <laughs> <laughs> I like the whole togetherness of it. I'm a bit of a lonely person, really. I just need friends. Bro, what's your question? Bro, uh, <laughs> I reckon, yeah. What? What? Oh, bro, when does this come? Funny watching you think. Okay, so you're on trial, yeah. That's your question. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes, yes. <laughs> you're on trial. Are you just coming to chill with us? What are you doing here? <laughs> that is so what? <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> Here we go, you ready? Here's the big one. Alright, okay. Alright, no, I've got one. I've got one. Mm. <laughs> if you could. Mm. If you could, would you? <laughs> if you could, <laughs> would you? <laughs> right. Would you do it? If you could. Would you do would it? Would you? <laughs> okay. Alright. Okay. Alright. <laughs> oh, okay, alright. <laughs> 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 
Do you know what, yeah? If you got, if you were given an opportunity to tour with any artist in the world, who would it be? <laughs> any artist in the world, okay. Finally. Hmm. <laughs> so long for one question. And it can be chicks. Like, you got to think, man. Like, you can, you can feature on some chicks tracks. Well, you don't think. That depends what the route is. Honestly, it'd probably have to be Bruno. Yeah, Bruno Mars. Big Bruno. That we big Bruno. So big not Bruno. road trip. The double thing. What about us? <laughs> If I could go until surely this would be. Bro, that was your initiation. That was your initiation. You just failed your initiation. You absolute pelters. <laughs> Have I fluffed it? No, mate, you got no chance. Go for it. Um. <laughs> just comes, comes back and goes, nah, you got any tricks? <laughs> um. Blood on yourself, bro. That's a party trick. I did that on your first day as well. Oh, that was. You got your toe out. That's a good party trick. Quick throwback to that, mate. There it is. Just one second. Get your toe out. It was so fast. He's in those 15 minutes. I was laying across Ryan's lap, staring into his eyes. Thanks for welcoming me. What was the thing you were most nervous about before coming that you're now like, ah, why was I even bothered? Good question. All right. Well, I know my answer, and I know you're gonna mug me off as soon as I say this answer. But the thing I was most nervous about was fitting in. That, yeah, there we go, there we go, right on. Sneeze! I've got a follow up. Why are we nervous about <laughs> something most of the preempts do to think that? So why was I most nervous about like, trying to. Because everyone's like, met new groups of friends before. Why this specific dynamic did you really know uh, about? Because you've been a tight knit group for like a long time now. You've been living together. It's not like you're just a standard group of mates. Pals go home at the end of the day. They don't live together. They don't work on the same dream together. Like, they're pals, and then they go and do their work, they go and do whatever. You guys have been together, living with each other, working hard on something for a long time. That's a scary thought to come in. Because at the end of the day, I have to be up to scratch. Like, I can't be behind. You are like miles ahead of what I'm doing, and I've got to try as quickly as I can to try and, like, fit them up. Is there anyone individually that you thought might be trickier to get along with from what you've seen online? From what I've seen online? He ain't going to be a problem, is he? Look at him. <laughs> Question, come on, man. But anyone I was worried that I wouldn't get along with. Yeah, yeah. or that you were like, ah, oh, I hope they like me, or ah, oh, I don't think we'll get along. No, oh, I said this actually. I, I said this to Jack. The person I was most nervous about meeting was Jack, because I I'd like briefly bumped into you guys before. I like, obviously knew Andy before, but like we'd met, like the ice was broke. I, I, this was completely fresh for me. And Jack. <laughs> Jack's an intimidating character. If you don't know Jack and you look at him, you're like, ah. whoa. Yeah. You have to ask each one of us a question now about your time in the band. Go on, Sonny Jim. About my time in the band. In the trial process of the band, yeah. He's been here three days, four days max. Yeah, but Robbie forces him to doing this, so we got <laughs> So we're sticking to it. Brooke, what was you most nervous about when I was coming down? Do you know what? I was worried, yeah. Is this a serious answer? Yeah, that's <laughs> I feel like it's really yeah. not going to no, be serious. No. <laughs> um, it, it was actually like... Not if you're gonna like me or not, genuinely. That's actually really cute. Oh, utter loser. No, that was sweet. I've just got a big, big red heart inside of my chesticles. And my red trackies. Mate, you said you'd marry that. You said you'd marry that. Bro, if I was a girl, I'd be different. Leave him alone. <laughs> <laughs> I'd be intellectual, more intellectual, because I feel like women are smarter. Right. I mean, any, going, it's not hard to be roll. smarter than me anyway, so, no. okay, and I'd, I'd probably eat a lot of jelly babies, right? <laughs> <laughs> because, because, no, I'll tell you why. Because as a woman, I'd probably care, like, I'd care, I'd just go to the gym a lot more and I'd feel like I'd burn it off quicker. <laughs> <laughs> you, you asked why I said I would marry him. That, in a nutshell, is why I would marry Brooke out of all of them. <laughs> if I was a girl, I'd be better. <laughs> Jelly babies, how did we get there? <laughs> why? What is going on? We can right. never let him speak on TV. <laughs> so, Ever. Sonny said, what were you most nervous about? And it turned into, I'd eat a load of jelly babies. <laughs> like, in a minute. Even like, over a whole <laughs> period of time. <sighs> Do you know what? I don't like how you encourage him. 
Yeah. Oh, I encourage it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Is well, it he's, stressful? Been, he's been extremely active yeah. the last three days, and it's been really hard to control him. <laughs> and I'm not a fan, man. I usually have him in such a... Don't I? He does. He's a docile place. <laughs> I usually have him in such no. a good place. Ignore Since him. you've got him, he's not like <laughs> lovey-dovey nah. hat eyes. Ignore him. Vlog, come in. Brooke, Brooke come gets in. excited by changing new people. Sonny coming in, and Brooke was like, Oh, someone else I can, like, play with. And at right. the same time, they are from the same area as well. Yeah, they, they love each other. Common ground, my friend. Yeah, I mean, Brooke, Brooke and I, I have literally zero common ground. Don't be like that. Go on, tell me <laughs> one thing. One thing other than the fact that we have the same fake hair colour. Right. the same right Well, I'll tell you now, right? We both love jelly babies. <laughs> we both love jelly babies. I actually hate jelly yeah, babies. No, so, 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 so do I. Common ground, bro. See, so you're a liar then. No, no. If he was a girl, he'd like <laughs> a girl. So it's the opposite. Oh, take that off, right? Oh yeah, they've just exposed the, the monkey. Uh, oh, why did you do that? You absolute... It's not like everyone knew. Okay, what's... What is... I, I'm intrigued to see you answer something with your heart. Yeah, right, watch this. <laughs> what do you mean from your heart? Nah, <laughs> and we're back. And we're back in the room. Hello. <laughs> 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 I have a question. <laughs> what it's was that? Oh, what was that? that? <laughs> Oh, can I, I've actually got two questions now. Can I ask you two? Yeah, go for okay, it. Okay, right. And you're actually going to answer them too. Why does he get Why does he get two, bro? <laughs> because it's taken me nearly 15 minutes to think of two. <laughs> That's why. Go on. Okay, yeah, but, yeah. right. Because I asked what's the most annoying. What's the best thing I've done? Actually, no. What surprised you the most since I've been here? Have I done anything that surprised you? Yeah. Um, obviously, I have a pre-existing relationship with you. As you've said four times now. <laughs> Suck <laughs> my <laughs> Ryan. Five no. for that. Yeah, I mean, Randy's on the ropes. Um, <laughs> <laughs> He's on band tonight. Um, yeah, no, I think the thing that surprised me the most when you came in was your surprise at what goes on here. I think it was kind of like a like a love of the amount of hard work. I was like, I love that he loves it. Like, I thought you'd come in and be like, this is so different to what I'm used to. This is a challenge. I'm tired. Like, it's going to take a while to get used to. You came in, you were like... I love how much you guys do, and I want to be a part of it, and that's like just the biggest thing for us. So, oh, that's so cute. lovely. That's, that's that one was cute. Answer. Now ask me another one, mate. <laughs> I don't know. No, the other question's pretty much the same now. I've, I've decided to scrap it, and you're not going to change my mind. Doesn't matter what you say to me. So you're bullying ever. me again. Ever. Favoritism <laughs> as well. We don't do favoritism here. No, no, no. Except no. for if it's to write. Yeah. 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 That is okay. Or me. Yeah, or Brooke. Or Brooke. Anybody got any of my thoughts would be good. So no one would be nice to me apart No, 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 we can be nice. Yeah. Just no favouritism, so I'm going to have like to stop doing that now. Do you like my car, though? What? Um, I mean, it's good. It's not my favourite. <laughs> See? <laughs> good answer! Jack's me and you trained as hell, man. It's <laughs> so good. Um, right, so, you know, <coughs> I'll throw your interview for tonight and, you know, do it well. What's what going is on? that? Where's the big cup from? <laughs> sums up the house. It's been a wacky few days. Uh, we've worked hard and I'm excited to get cracking on again tomorrow. Boom! Can we do that girl that, that made the face? Who's How this? are you doing vlog? Grand we Tom's are Shatter. going to be reacting to all the reaction videos of the new cover that came out yesterday. Justin Bieber and Ed Sheeran, <laughs> I Don't Care. So there's a reaction to road trip cover of I Don't Care by, can we read that? Joanne Gold. Joanne Gold. Joanne. I, don't, I don't know Joanne Gold's channel. I think I recognise the face though. Go on Joanne. Hey everyone, my name oh, is Joanne. Hi Joanne! Joanne! <laughs> right, let's see what she thinks. She looks friendly. Sunny said she looks friendly. <laughs> Here we go! Nice. Oh, she's Welsh. She's Welsh. Hello. You can do a good Welsh accent, can't you? Sunny Zen. Loves it, I do. Oh, well done, <laughs> sir. That was good. Listening to it. No, she Irish. Yeah, she's Irish. I can tell. I can tell. Oh, I don't know. She's Welsh. Yeah, I don't. What are you, Joanne? Maybe she's Welsh-ish. She's Irish. Watch it a day later because she knows about Ryan Sunny already. No. Yeah, she's Welsh. Yeah, she's Welsh. 
Sonny. Yes, Joanne. Oh, that was really sweet. She sent us like it's our song. We didn't write these lyrics, Joanne. <laughs> but thank you for liking thank them. You. Maybe she thinks it's our song. She seems to be enjoying it, which is good. She's bopping her head, mate. She's bopping. She's bopping. Wait, yeah, wait, oh, that trend. Wait, wait, shh. Oh, that trend. Harmony, you think that? Yeah, it's a harmony. Come at me, come at me. Alright, oh. alright then. Come on, Joanne. Come on, Joanne. Come on, Joanne. Come on, Yeah, she's loving you, mister. Sunny's coming up. I want to. Let's see what she says. She's going to Sunny's coming. She's vibing, then. Jack's loving her. You're alright, Oh, she's actually really yeah. sweet. She's really nice. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. nah. <laughs> What's she gonna say, right? Yes, the Harmony Ooze. <laughs> She's Irish, Jake. <laughs> Harmony Ooze. Where's Randy at? <laughs> Go on, Joanne. Love and take this home. Yeah. She's <laughs> full on TikTok in it. Right, I'm kind of in shock at the moment because. Who's this new fella? Who is he? Who is he? He looks a spitting image of Mr. Mikey Cole. Why does Mikey like, look a spitting him. image of him? Because he was what? in a boy band this is, first. This is quite funny, yeah? Because you know what? When Mikey joined this band, what the Blair heck? actually said, because obviously uh, Sonny had worked with Blair before, Blair actually said, yeah, he needs to look a bit like, a bit like Ryan Robertson. <laughs> like a bit like Ryan Robertson sort of vibe. So Mikey actually got moulded off, off of Ryan in the first place, <laughs> which is quite funny. And then he's come back to claim the crown. Full circle. Can't crown. say that. Reincarnation. <laughs> oh no no no. Joey Oeo. Oh, okay. Joey Oeo oh, is good. Joey Oeo. Oh, oh Jack. Oh no. Mikey's changed. <laughs> <laughs> Wrong way round, Jerry, but thank you. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> I made him. Whoa. Here we go. I just think he's being way more shadowed. We're easing you into it, Joe. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't feel as good. It's like the vocals are amazing, but like. I just, I miss Mikey. Um, um, we expected Don't varying worry. reactions. Don't like, worry. He'll we, come round. We yeah. won't put that in. No one misses Mikey. <laughs> I miss Mikey. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Oh. He went from vibing to. Oh. <laughs> I think he's gonna cry. I love that, mate. I think you smash that. Thank, Thank you, sir. He really wants to enjoy it as well. Random as a whole needs like some time, I think. <laughs> he's creeping. I mean, <laughs> he's creeping. I mean, they're wrong. <laughs> he's mad. You can't replace Mikey, to be fair. I mean, we did. <laughs> <laughs> he's right there. Yeah, he's there. Whee! He's being so modest about it. He's like, that's my main problem. So soon. Man doesn't stop Literally. for anyone, my friend. Damn it was a fast Why turnaround. He wasn't actually nasty about it. He wasn't. Oh. He just said his opinion. He doesn't like. Fair he, he said he, he didn't not like you. He just didn't like the timing of it. Problem if he's the one joining the band. Right? <laughs> <laughs> I smell a rant coming on. This is Mikey's cake reaction. I, I don't know Mikey's cake. It's wait, a cake it's made of Mikey's. Wait, wait, wait. Why does she have a Mikey shrine? Oh wait, pause it. That's Mikey. Yeah. There's a few Mikey's. <laughs> yes. Oh, she loved it. Here we go. Maybe not. That kind of shook me up a lot. Like. Wow. Um, my opinion, if Ryan's gonna be like the new member of Road Trip, to be honest, I don't really mind too much. Whoa! Yay! Yay! Wait, 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 there's a but. Of course, just like Mikey leaving is still like not completely sunk in yet. Like, yeah, it's gonna take some getting used to, but no, right. I like him. Like, he, yeah. he was good in Overload, he's good in that video. Yay! That's from Mikey's cake as well. Yeah. That's Mikey's good. actual cake. <laughs> I'd like him to change his name, please, because I don't want there to be two Ryans. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Sonny, Sonny, we've ticked the box. We freaking <laughs> sorted it. That was her one condition to like you, and we've already done it. That was actually quite sweet. That was, was really yeah. surprised. And she did also touch on the fresh wound kind of vibe too. Mm. Didn't she? <laughs> That's a horrible way of describing it. you know what? Andy, Andy put some tweets out, and this is this is why it's a, a quick move for us, because we've known Mikey's been going for a long time. Like It's been like a deteriorating sort of process, and we just wanted to give him the opportunity to see if like it's something he wanted to continue doing. And obviously he chose not to be here. Blair had been speaking to Ryan for a long time, uh, building up a relationship again, and Ryan was aware and got himself prepared, 
Uh, he's done this before in another band, so he's fully ready for it. It's not like we've just picked someone who had no pre-existing, pre-existing relationship with Alpha Dog Family or Road Trip and just went, here, you'll do in the band. It's like we used to do with the old Charlie. The old Charlie used to come in, like when we tried like 20 people or whatever when we built the initial band, and they'd come in for like a fleeting moment and we'd be like, are you good enough? Are you not good enough? And fine, because we had nothing else to go off. Whereas now we knew we had the band, we had the, the culture from the fan base. We, we knew what we needed from someone. And Ryan ticked all those boxes a long time before we'd even thought about putting him in the band. And Blair had been speaking to him. And then when it came to him coming over, this is still his trial process. We're still not 100% on it. And we need to figure that out over the next few weeks. But I mean, your guys' response to him so far is a majority vote that he's wicked. We love him. He's yeah. sick. But you never you know. Guys. But ne- next week he might change his mind and we'll have, to, we'll have to find out what happens but it doesn't, <laughs> doesn't look like that's going to happen if he leaves as well no, <laughs> if he leaves out. now this isn't a spontaneous let's just put someone in the band and see if it works it's like it's, we can't just stop the train because a member decides to leave if someone decides to leave they're no longer with the dream they're no yeah. longer in what is our career as well remember this isn't just like us uh, being mates every day like we are friends all the time and it's a byproduct of what we do but we are also working 24-7 and that can't stop like for anyone um, so bringing bringing Sonny in was more of an immediate thing because we have to keep our we have to keep going with our careers. Sometimes you gotta just for you. build a bridge. Exactly. Wouldn't stop for me. And wouldn't stop get for over him. it. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, yeah. It, doesn't, it doesn't stop for anyone. And we, we didn't want to stop the pace for you guys either. Like, we could have gone quiet for a bit, but then I feel like we would have disappointed you all. So, if anything, Sonny making the decision to, like, balls up and come in straight away Excitement. was kind of like... For, yeah, it took a lot of courage, man. To be, yeah, I was going to say, he knew he was coming <laughs> in. And he knew he was coming in and there was going to be a small portion of people that would be like, I don't like it, I'm not, I'm not used to the change. And my point earlier was that that is just shock. Like, it's not like a hatred of him. No one's gone, I hate Sonny. They've gone, I don't like that the change has come about so quickly, but that's just like a shock thing that will dissi- dissipate in about a week. Mm. And then it will just be like normality. Like he's still on trial right now. You guys will just start getting more and more used to him the more you see him in this sort of content. We'll, we'll always have a piece of Mikey in our heart, but like just he's out of the band now and we need to move on and he needs to move on. And the best way we thought moving on was making the change quickly and kind of getting over it in that way. And we found a f- member that's just insanely good at being in a boy band and deserves it massively like this isn't just someone we've picked off social media this is someone who's been through the rings before spent years building something had it taken away from him and then come back to it with like every bit of energy he's got and delivered on everything which is why we wanted to announce it in a music video and not on like some like simple instagram post like to say here's a new trialist guys like we didn't think that was justification enough we wanted to go here he is as a boy band member and as a singer and as a performing artist because that's what we are and we thought that'd be the best way to kind of deliver it to you guys and we knew it'd be a bit of a shock as well we like surprising you guys Mm -hmm. it's kind of fun yeah that was one of the main issues i saw like oh as if you put him in a cover straight away what you guys seem to be forgetting all people that have come along since we've been a five is that jack was in two covers and a tour before he was announced in the band yeah so as we started to gain some form of traction online we were so busy all the time that we couldn't afford to keep a secret for six months and then be like right keep them out of everything we'll just like work around you and not really get to see what you're actually like until we decide you're in so this was like Sonny's first test in the same way Jack went through a few of them as well Brooke was in a cover before he was officially in he did hello acoustically with me and Rye Mikey Mikey filmed all of our covers and did DM sprees and stuff like that before he was in the band like we have to put people through being in the band before we can decide yeah you're ready Mm. to be in it like, and the first test was going on a cover with a million subscribers and he worked and hard singing and, and performing and eight in the morning yeah buzzing mm. that's really good bloody wicked he's so fat fit jack. so fat jack he's so fat oh that was cute that was so cute <laughs> yeah <laughs> you guys are like proper FBI agents. Like we didn't, didn't even allude to any of it. Yep, overload. Yeah, I know where he lives. I know how many dogs he's got. I mean, he's a good no, guy. No one can replace Mikey. He's a good guy. Uh, maybe Grace's. So this is Grace Dushby's channel. She's very diplomatic and very switched on Grace. Grace. Just hit a thousand subscribers. Make sure you're one of the next thousand. Um, so. so you think Grace would look at it quite logically, like? Yeah, no. From what it is. Which is Grace. Grace makes this song literally came out last night, so I'm really excited to see what the boys have produced because they've been working so hard on it. It yes, came out yesterday. 36 hours straight. See? She knew oh, how much effort that went. A lot of effort went into that. I like the eyebrows. I thought Jack could do this. I listened to this song at school. I was like, Jack's gonna do this. But... <laughs> <laughs> Wait, listen. Um, 
<laughs> that was quite funny. It's like you can see your mind ticking, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like thinking what, about what it. What do I say? It's just blown my mind. I can't like actually like react. Aww, how cute. She looks like she's gonna cry. You made her cry. I feel bad now. No. <laughs> I I really don't know what to say. It might not have seemed like it, but I really did love that cover. Like I love the whole setup. They all sounded so good and like they all look good and everything like that. It was just a massive shock. I'm just really shocked that they haven't told us before. I think if they told us another mm -hmm. video out. But that's when, what we went for. Exactly. We wanted to shock yeah. everyone. Yeah, exactly. I think it's Ryan that was in overload. <laughs> hey! Sunny! Like a really good voice. Yeah. She said I've got a good voice. Yeah, and it fits with the band. Go on, Grace. So, like, just putting it out there was proper, like, brave of the boys. I'll give that to them. Yeah. Got a lot of balls. Yes, Grace! So many balls! So many balls! <laughs> so many balls! <laughs> Two, four, six. <laughs> <laughs> I'm lucky guys, I'm really sorry. So Grace, fairness, yeah, go on. everything she said was completely fair. It is, because yeah. it was very soon. Everyone's but, allowed an opinion, but, aren't they? Alright, yeah. but here's, here's my point to that, yeah? Show us a band that has done it at the appropriate time. Because, like, there's no there's no rule book to it. Yeah, you when... Just, there, there, there isn't a school for this. You just kind of do it. When One Direction put George Shelley in to replace Zayn, everyone yeah, hated yeah, it. Yeah, everyone was like, what is going on? Yeah. There was and two then, Larry Styles in the yeah, band. Yeah, and then Bob Marley joined JLS. Everyone was like, everyone I don't like it. Yeah, don't like yeah it. man. Um, but no, on a legit... <laughs> like, th like we, we didn't know how long to wait or if it was too soon or if there was... like We, we just knew we wanted to crack on and keep pushing forwards as fast as we can. And that was the best way to do it. This is the hardest and the fastest the band has been working. Despite yeah. obviously Mikey going through some like personal stuff that like made him not want to be here. But we worked really hard despite that. We've got someone come in who's like really eager to like get on that train with yeah. us. We're working even harder. So we're like, well, why not reward that by just getting you out in the world as quickly as we can? Like we are the hardest working app properly on the mm. internet. Not only that, as you're alluding to, there's so much coming up for road trip mm. that there's no time to waste. Yeah, we can't waste being like, oh, Izzy, you know, the band, we need to get him like rehearsed, prepared, test him every day and find out what we can do. And that right, it's sunny. It is indeed. <laughs> and exactly. I just want to say as well, obviously, I was kind of expecting mixed reviews. Like, not everyone was going to be pleased with this. That, that's obvious, you know. But I just want to say, like, and address this. Like, I'm not here to replace anyone. Like, I know I've got to work hard. Like, the boys have been a group now together for a long time. They've been working hard. I know I've got to wear my stripes. Boys She's wearing stripes! Yeah. 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 I'm playing that. You are <laughs> earning it, bro. You're you smashing are. it. So, no, and thanks to the roadies that have said, like, such wonderful things. And, yeah, you've welcomed me. Yeah, and to the ones who haven't, haven't said, said wonderful things, things, they will soon. So, yeah. He's going yeah, to win, gonna win you over. You that just cracking watch. smile, my friend. Exactly. Look Go at on. that. <laughs> that was fun. Thank I you for all the view reactions. Do keep them yes. coming because we genuinely do go through and watch them. We get good feedback from them every now and again. We'll be like, oh, I didn't think about it like that. And some of you psychoanalyze them like really well. And they're like, well, maybe that's why they did that. We didn't, but thank you. <laughs> so yeah, keep your reactions coming. Much love. See you on the flip side. <laughs> 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 See you tomorrow. Adios. Bye. Bye. <laughs> <laughs>